Don't go to church on Sunday. Don't get down on my knees and pray. Don't memorize the books of the Bible. Got my own special way. I know Jesus loves me. Maybe just a little bit more. Get down on my knees every Sunday. To Elderly's Candy Store. Gotta be a chocolate Jesus. Makes me feel so good inside. Gotta be a chocolate Jesus to keep me satisfied. Don't want no Abba Zabba. Don't want no one in George. There ain't nothing better suitable. For this boy Well it's the only thing That can pick me up Better than a cup of gold See only a chocolate Jesus can Satisfy my soul It's rough and there's whiskey in the shade Best to wrap your savior up in cellophane He floats like the big muddy But that's okay Just pour him over ice cream Nice parfait Gotta be a chocolate Jesus Good enough for me Gotta be a chocolate Jesus Good enough for me Gotta be a chocolate Jesus Makes me feel so good inside Gotta be a chocolate Jesus To keep me satisfied I said to keep me satisfied I said it's gotta be a chocolate Jesus Baby, if you wanna see me Whew. It's been a long time since I played that one. Who diggity. So there we go. That, I, I've done that song better. It's been a really long time since I've played that song. I could probably transpose it to make it easier, but uh, I think it sounds best in, uh, the, in D minor. Um, I don't know. It sounds pretty good. But hey, let's learn how to play it. Let's jump right into uh, the tutorial. I'm going to do these things in reverse order. Sometimes, sometimes I'll do the song first and then the tutorial, and sometimes the tutorial first and then the song. We'll see what happens. So that was the playthrough. That was uh, "Chocolate Jesus" by Tom Waits. Tom Waits does this song a lot of different ways. Uh, my favorite way, I believe, is when he's on David Letterman show. And he sings it through a megaphone and there's a banjo playing in the back, uh, a stand-up bass, a keyboard, and a drummer. And it's kind of 
random and wonky and cool and I liked it a lot especially the megaphone thing I don't have a megaphone otherwise I would have sing it through a megaphone but uh, let's learn how to play it not a tricky song uh, it's got four chords actually it's got three chords my mistake three chords in the whole song so let's get right to it the first chord is a minor chord actually uh, two of the chords are minor chords but don't fret they're not as difficult as they sound the first one is the D minor and again I will put the diagrams up for <clears throat> you guys to see over here so the D minor D minor is nice and easy you take your pointer finger and you put it on the E string second string from the bottom on the first fret now there's two ways to play this the next thing we need to do is we need to cover the C string and the G string, the top and the second from the top. We need to cover both of those with our fingers. So we can either do, we have our pointer finger on the first fret E string. We can take these two, the middle finger and the ring finger and plunk those down up on top to get our D minor. Um, well, that's the wrong way, kind of like that. But I am not comfortable with my big fat fingers playing that way. The way I play it, is I take my middle finger, sorry everybody, and I bar the top two strings with my middle finger. So I'm actually only using two fingers, but I'm getting this string and this string, both of these. Now, the one thing you're gonna hear, that's the D minor, nice and easy, that's the way I play it. Or again, you can play it like this if you want to. Um, one of the things that you hear in the song is that, Da 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 Much better when I'm actually playing it properly. The way I achieve that myself, I'm not sure if Tom did it that way, is when I've got my D, I will simply lift my pointer finger off. So it sounds sounds like this. And then I'll hammer it back on, giving it that wow. on the first fret right nice and easy now we're gonna go to our next minor chord which is a G minor G minor used to really I used to find it tricky and difficult but it's not really that bad so again we're going with our pointer finger on the first fret but on the first string the bottom string the um, A string and then um, pointer finger there now it gets a little bit trickier we're gonna go with the middle finger and we're going to put it on the C string, like that. the C string on the second fret, right? And then we're going to take this ring finger and we're going to drop it right down here on the third fret on the E string. So that's the second from the bottom. Now this can be a little tricky, especially when you have to get used to jumping. So what I normally do is I, when I jump here, I jump and plant my pointer finger first. And then I typically find it easier to kind of drop the next two. So this is when we're using the first, second, and third fret. We're using the E string on the, oh, sorry, the A string on the first fret. The E string, or sorry, the C string, all the way up here on the second fret. And the E string, there it is finally, on the third fret. That's a G minor. And again, if you want to give it that da, 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 da. Lift that pointer finger, right? So we're going to yes. All right. So that's the G minor. Now we have so far our D minor and our G minor. Majority of the song. Don't go to church on Sunday. Don't get down on my knees and pray. Don't memorize the books of the Bible. And now we're going into the third fret, or the third chord, which is nice and easy. It's an A7. A7 is used with one finger. It's a one finger chord. And it is the C string on the first fret. That's it. That's an A7, a lovely chord. I do enjoy it. 
So those are our three chords. Let's quickly go over them here. So we have here, we have here, D minor, we have here, we have here, we have here, G minor, and then we have A7, the whole song, okay? So let's take a look at the, the verse and the chords are pretty much the same. It's just a matter of time. So D minor, sing the whole first line till you get down on your knees and pray. And that's when we're going to change the G minor. And we do a while of that. Then we go back to our D minor and then to an A7. And then we repeat the pattern again with D minor. Now, that works for the verse and the chorus. The chorus being the, I know Jesus loves me, maybe it's a little bit more. Get down my knees every Sunday, is there all these candy, uh, candy store? The only difference being that on that particular one, we add, well, we just go back to the D minor again right at the end. So it's no different than just switching to D minor. So basically it's D minor, G minor, D minor, A7, whole song. The only part that gets tricky after that is the uh, little bridge where he says, when the weather gets rough and it's whiskey in the shade, best to wrap your saver up in cellophane. Um, the only difference here is that we're swapping the G minor and the D minor. So we start off with the, when the weather gets rough and it's whiskey in the shade, best to wrap your savior up in Cellophane. See, now in that situation, we did the whole first line with the G minor and then went to the D minor. And then we go back to our G minor. Sorry. He floats like a big muddy. But that's okay. And then we go to our A7. Pour him over ice cream for a nice parfait. So let's let's go through the first first couple verses and then we'll do the bridge and then you'll know how to play the entire song. So it starts off with D minor. Don't go to church on Sunday. Don't get down on my knees and G minor. Pray. Don't memorize the books of the D minor Bible. And then A7. Got my own special way. Back to D minor. I know Jesus loves me. Maybe just a little bit G minor. More. Get down on my knees every at Sunday. We're gonna go back to D minor. Sunday. A minor at Zereldelis. A seven, sorry. Zereldelis. Gaddy store. Back to that D minor. And here's the little chorus. But again, same chords. Gotta be a chocolate Jesus Makes me feel so good in G minor side Gotta be a chocolate D minor Jesus D minor to keep me A7 Sorry, I keep saying A minor A7 Keep me D minor satisfied It's because there's so many minors in the rest of the song then we go to don't want no abba zabba, don't want no I'm enjoy, yeah, etc. etc. Again, same pattern, D minor, G minor, A7, right? Now, once we get to the last part here, we're getting to that when the whiskey, when the weather gets rough and it's whiskey in the shade, G minor. When the weather gets rough 
and there's whiskey in the shade. Best to wrap your savior up in D minor cellophane. Now we're going back to G minor. He floats like the big muddy. But that's okay. And then we go into a rousing round of A7. But pour him over ice cream for a nice parfait. And then back in D minor. And then it's D minor, G minor, and A7, the rest of the song for the, past, uh, the last couple choruses. But that's it. D minor, G minor, A7. You want to liven it up a bit? Just lift that uh, pointer finger. it guys listen to the playthrough go through it a couple times practice those chords they're going to be right here on the side uh, three chord song can't go wrong and it's tom waits um do it your own style i'm doing it sir Anne style tom waits has a very distinctive style you're never going to do it tom waits style so don't even bother trying um do it your style make it your own have fun with it see you next video